I chose to make some fun things, first of all. This was the very first thing that, um, that I downloaded offline and brought it here to the library, not knowing, you know, would they be willing to do something like this. Uh, this is what they call scatter terrain for a um, Star Wars game called Legion. Uh, once I saw the beauty of this thing and the detail, uh, I kind of went crazy. <laughs> and bought a lot of STL files online and started bringing more and more in. Everything you see here was done here at the Metro Public Library and the staff has been incredibly helpful. They even uh, at one point said, are you building Tatooine? There are different structures here. There's a, a, a desert official building, uh, there's a destroyed home, there's a laser cannon. And then this piece I brought to show you that you can actually do larger structures uh, in multiple pieces. So at some point I will have to like, you know, glue this together and put the roof on. The fact is, is that it's unlimited in the scope of what you can do. It doesn't matter if you're a hobbyist, if you're a small business, uh, if you're a, a game player like I am, uh, there's all kinds of uses, uh, things for schools, things for churches, things for your family, Christmas gifts. I would encourage anyone who is at all interested in 3D printing is to come in and talk to the people here at the Mentor Public Library. Um, if you just have some things you want printed, uh, they'll be glad to help you. Uh, they are already starting to do classes uh, and little workshops that will help you understand uh, what you're getting into. Uh, it's not expensive, really. Uh, so I would just say uh, keep an eye on the uh, Mentor Public Library's website and see what they've got going on because I think this is only going to get bigger and grow and if you're interested in technology, if you're interested in prototyping, if you're interested in just playing games like me, uh, it's a great resource to have.